wish all the students of class 3 a very good morning today i am going to teach you a new chapter from your half yearly syllabus that is chapter 5 water is priceless so all of you go to page number 40 this story is about long long time back ago when people people means king and the prince uh, they used to poach animal they used to hunt animal but nowadays hunting is banned if anyone will hunt animal that person will go to the jail so long time back ago once a king went into a jungle for hunting one day a king went into the jungle for hunting he spotted a deer he followed it deep into the jungle suddenly he saw a deer and he ran after the deer deep into the jungle by following it suddenly the deer went out of sight but inside the jungle there is lack of light sunlight so uh, and the deer could run run very fast maybe that is the reason why the deer went out of sight out of vision the king came out of the jungle too tired and thirsty but he found no water then what happened the king came out of the jungle and he was very tired and very thirsty because he was running after the deer and unfortunately he also lost the sight of it but he found no water there was no water in the jungle he sat down on a rock he felt like dying of thirst now this thirsty and tired king sat down on a rock and he was feeling as if he will die out of thirst after some time he saw a man carrying water when he was sitting on the rock suddenly he saw a man who was carrying some water the king asked for water to save his life now the king asks that man to give him some water and save his life but what did the man do the man put a demand for his kingdom as a reward the man asked demanded not asked the man demanded for the kingdom of the king in as a reward for giving him the water the king promised and the man gave him water now the thirsty king was so much in thirst he was so much thirsty that he agreed to that demand he said okay i will give you my kingdom now please give me some water refreshed the king offered the man to take charge of his kingdom now after drinking the water when the king was feeling quite refreshed and his thirst was fulfilled by the water that was given by the man this king offered his kingdom to that man and asked him to take charge of it the man burst into laughter he said water is so precious that you were willing to give up your kingdom but i don't want anything now as soon as the king offered to take charge of his kingdom to that man the man burst out into laughter and said is water that much precious that you are even willing to give up your kingdom to me but i don't want anything then the man said that i have a request never waste water please ask your public also never to waste water every drop of water is precious now the man asks the king that he don't want anything and he only have a request that the king in his kingdom he want all the people in the king's kingdom never to waste water and every each and every drop of water is precious this all the people of his kingdom should understand so this was a short and moral story about how precious water is i hope all of you have liked it thank you